Hi Resonators, welcome to Tammyosity, I'm Tammy. In this video, I'm making a personalized wedding gift for one of our clients at our wedding venue. These are the colors that I'll be using. The bride's favorite colors are mustard yellow and forest green. The first thing I did to the Lazy Susan is I sanded the top. I wanted to sand off the shiny part, the varnish, and also smooth over the edges so the resin can drip off the edges easier. And now I'm just taping the back so I can easily remove the drips that'll be on the back side. I'm starting with a coat of the gray, which is flow uh, pigment. It's a flow pigment and it should help create cells. And then after this first coat, I'll start adding the color. I want to make sure I have a good base coat of resin before I start pouring the colors so the resin has somewhere to go. It flows easier when you have a nice base coat laid down first. I'm starting with the forest green and then I'll move on to the mustard yellow. I got the idea of using the Lazy Susans as a personalized gift from watching RK3 Designs, so shout out to RK3 for giving me this idea. I want to give it a quick blast with the torch to get rid of any bubbles and then I'm going to come back with the heat tool to kind of spread around, I should say blend, blend these lines of colors so there isn't such a, so they don't look so stripey, you know, blend it a little bit better so that it just flows together. I love custom orders, so if you're going to a wedding and you want a personalized wedding gift, reach out to me. We can discuss the colors that you want and I'll create a Lazy Susan for your friends too. You can find me on Facebook and Instagram at Tamiosity where you can send a private message to create your custom order. Now I'm adding a green gold color. It's a mica powder so it's shimmery. It will add some shimmer to the forest green and the yellow, the mustard yellow. And I'm going to torch it once again to get rid of the bubbles and use the heat tool again to blend in the gold that I just laid down. You can see those bubbles almost right in the middle. It was, it's just bubbles coming up from the wood. And man, I was fighting that a lot. I had to keep taking, taking the torch to those bubbles that kept coming up and coming up. But finally it kind of sealed and those bubbles stopped. I created the monogram using the Cricut and I laid that down and then I did another clear coat of resin to seal the monogram in. And it turned out really pretty. The colors are very subtle. I think I should have waited for the resin to set up just a little bit because it kind of ran off too much and the color turned out a little more subtle than what I was hoping for, but the shimmer in it is really pretty. I really enjoy making these Lazy Susans for our clients, and I just picture that it will be on their dining room table for years to come, 
and they will tell all their friends that they got that from Ashley's backyard when they got married and it's just going to be something that they can treasure for a long long time so i hope you enjoyed this video and again if you are looking for a customized wedding gift just reach out to me it doesn't even have to be for a wedding it could even be for yourself it doesn't even have to be for a gift so i hope you enjoyed this video and i can't wait to show you my next project